Sweet. Yeah, you'd leave it there. It's one around. Yeah, I've, like honestly, I can get a pump straight away. This is like I really need to time the pump up. Uh, almost, almost three, I think, like two point five. Yeah, I'm, I'm just sitting on it basically. Yeah. Sweet. I'm, I'm happy with how, like, like easy I can get a pump. Yeah. Um, Shows that you're full. Yeah. No, that is literally. A, it's a great indication of how full I am. Is when I pose, like I can literally contract it. Mm -hmm. I can get better into posing. All you gotta do at this point, just keep checking that you're fully hydrated. Yeah, no, literally, hundred percent. I'm very confident. Yeah, good stuff. Let's do this thing, man. That's weird. Yeah, yeah. So we are at the Cambly Theatre now, a lovely venue for Lawrence's first show. We spent about an hour at the coffee shop just relaxing, basically before the show started. Lawrence is in the venue now. The rest of us haven't got tickets because we're very unorganised, but. Lawrence should be on at around 5 p.m. So we've got two more meals going in, around 120 carb in each meal. I'm gonna have a look at him after meal four, and then last meal will be at around 3:30, maybe a little bit earlier, just because we're on earlier than we initially thought. Just make sure he's going into that pump-up session, fully carbed up, looking very full, get enough water in as well to make sure he can get a good pump. And I'm very excited for his show. So yeah, looking forward to it. How's he? Uh, how's he looking at the minute? Looking very good, considering he woke up when I when I looked at him this morning. That was a flat look, well, flat look, and it was very full for a morning look. We know that Lawrence's physique changes a lot throughout the day, especially through drinking water, and that really makes a difference to his intramuscular fullness. So if it was a full look in the morning, I can't even imagine what it's gonna look like after five meals and six, seven litres of water. So yeah, should be a very good look on stage tonight. Yeah, yeah. Let's go. So as you can see, that was Lawrence at around two hours out. So I'm very happy with how his physique's progressed across the day. In the morning, he was a little bit flat, but I knew that he progresses throughout the day really nicely when he adds in water, fills up more intramuscularly. We've had about 750 carbs and he's still got 25 carb in his pre-stage pre drink with his pump-free workout. So he should be pretty much on the money. We try to push forward as much as we can without it distending his midsection basically because we know that once we push fullness too far he kind of holds a layer over his midsection which we don't want to have obviously that will hide his condition so yeah really really happy where he's at we've got about three more classes he'll stop pumping up in the break and then he'll be on in junior men's physique in about an hour's time from now Each of which will also qualify for the finals. So Isaac, you please set the third place trophy and the UK finals qualification. Present those to number 92, Peter Sanders. Your runner-up, 
runner up in second place tonight. Also qualified for the finals, Isaac presented an award to the number 19 Tom Bologna. Yes! Yes, yes Lauren! Come on. Which means your winner, first place, Southern County's Junior Physique Champion 2023. Number 97. Yes! Come on, mate! Ladies and gentlemen, please, as always, give it up for the guys that didn't crack the top three on this occasion. So there we go. Yeah. Can't be more proud of Lawrence. First place junior men physique. Never in doubt. So proud of what he's done over the last 24 weeks. He's put so much effort into it. He's not missed a single beat over the whole prep. Not one. Trusted me all the way through. The look we brought was amazing. Posing was amazing. Thank you to Kez for that. And yeah, we go again in two weeks for Leo's show. <laughs> two weeks, Heart of England, then five weeks to the finals. Let's go.